Each year, the editors of Truck Trend put a group of all new or significantly revised pickups to the test to determine which one will be their pickup truck of the year. This is how it's done. Yeah. All right, divvy up. Take these trucks out. We're going to head up north and start our test. All right, Jason, you're with me. Ed, you get the NV2500 Truck Trend van. John, why don't you and Brett take the uh, yellow Pro 4X, and Sean, you hop in with Jason and I. Let's get moving. Looking like a good old-fashioned road trip. We take these trucks out in the real world where they belong, tested in their natural environment across a variety of terrains. It's a marathon of long days, longer nights, and definitely more caffeine than is probably healthy. For us, what you see is what you get. So we test the trucks as they come from the factory. And the outcome is driven by the data we gather. Load her up. We use 100 pound rubber mats to load these trucks down to their maximum payload right. and 75% of their rated towing capacity. Yeah. Good. Actually, what's nice is the camera on this one is pretty high definition on the dash, so you can see the picture really clear. All right, let's go. Pickup Truck of the Year is a fundamentally different award. There are no secret ballots, no conference room decisions, and no popularity contests. This year, we had eight trucks in our field. They're all great trucks in their own right, and I don't think any of us went into it thinking the Titan was gonna win. When the scoring came out and people were that excited about the Titan, it was kind of a dark horse in the race. Isn't it funny how you go on a road trip and you could be driving across country and not talk for three hours, you mostly just grunt? <clears throat> pushing these trucks beyond the limits of what's expected. We cover thousands of miles on the pavement to assess ride comfort, handling, towing performance, and more. Dangerous curves ahead. Bum, bum, bum. The power from the 5.6 liter V8 is phenomenal. Even loaded down to 75% of the capacity of this truck. I don't feel the trailer acting on the Titan at all. No, the, the trailer is actually really stable on here. It, it's a large trailer. We have a 20-foot deck, and it's all steel. Uh, it's pretty solid. Remember that time that we did a Facebook Live and some dude from Saudi Arabia asked why we're all so fat? Yep. Did that hurt your feelings at all? Not even in the slightest. No, me either. Off the highway, we venture down rough roads, over sandy washes, and through tight trails to evaluate the tires, gearing, and traction aids. One of the fun things about the uh, Titan Pro 4X is just the way the chassis is set up and the way they've tuned the Bilstein shocks. Titan has great brakes, great steering, and those are all things that really matter on the street. But what people don't realize is, you know, this stuff matters off-road as well. It's really easy to pitch it sideways and get around a corner, and in some trucks you can't even do that. The Titan, our uh, 2017 Pickup Truck of the Year winner, 390 horsepower. 394, pound feet of torque. The thing that shocked us was how close the numbers were between unladen and laden. I mean, it's just the, the almost like the, the engine doesn't care. Going down the highway, it's, it's quiet, towing a load, as we did in our testing this afternoon, from zero to 60, quarter mile, loaded, unloaded, the truck performs everywhere. You know, spending more time with these trucks, it just reinforces, you know, our opinion and, and what we came up with that uh, we feel really good about our pickup truck of the year. I mean, Nissan's done a fantastic job with it, and uh, we stand behind it.